Finally, your data arrives at the network access layer, which is responsible for getting your package physically delivered. Think of this layer as the delivery trucks and postal workers who actually carry your package from one place to another. This layer handles the physical transfer of your data across different networks and types of connections, Ethernet, Wi-Fi, fiber optic, and so on and so forth. At this point, the packet that is passed from the internet layer is wrapped in a new package called a frame. This frame includes a layer two header, which is crucial for local delivery. The layer two header contains the source MAC address, the unique address of your device, like the sender's return address, and the destination MAC address, the address of the next device along the way or the router. This ensures that the data is sent to the correct next stop within the local network. As your frames travel through various routers or switches, the layer two header is decapsulated and updated at each new router or hub. Much like how packages get relabeled as they pass through different postal sorting facilities. Each time the data moves closer to its final destination, a new layer two header is added with updated source and destination MAC addresses, ensuring accurate delivery at every step of the way. Once these frames reach the server, the server decapsulates them by peeling off each layer of information in reverse order, starting with the layer two header and then moving through the internet layer and the transport layer until the original data is eventually revealed. This process ensures that the data from a bunch of different packets is properly reassembled and the server can interpret the request. Once the request is fully processed, the server generates a response, such as the web page you requested, and then encapsulates the response back into frames, wrapping it in the appropriate headers for each layer before sending it back to your device. However, on the way back, the packets may not follow exactly the same path, and some packets might even take entirely different routes to reach your device.